Okay, hey everybody, it's your boy Philotico here, bringing you guys another cool English teaching video for you to help you expand your English. And what am I going to teach you guys today? I'm going to teach you in a very, very cool way. You're not going to be looking at me, you're going to be looking at the model in front of you. That's right, she is going to be here to help me. So what are we going to learn about? We are going to learn about the five fingers on the hand. That's right. We're going to learn about the five fingers on the hand. So let's get to it. Let's learn some cool American English. This finger, do you know what this finger is? This finger is the index finger. One of my favorite fingers. And how do we use this index or pointer finger, you may say. Index is more professional, but you can say pointer. How do we use this pointer finger? Well, we point at people or point at things. It might be bad to point at people, but we point at people or we point at things we may want. And also sometimes we may even use our finger to scratch or rub our nose or rub our eyes, which is bad because you can get coronavirus. So that's the pointer finger and that's how we use it. Now let's go to the middle finger. Now this finger is a little uh, hateful, so to say. This finger means something very, very bad. This finger is something very disrespectful. But the middle finger is the longest finger on your hand, and it's like the big brother of all of your fingers. But what does it mean when you use it by itself and turn the back toward the person? It means you don't like them. You don't care for them, and you kind of hate them. So that's the middle finger, and that's how we use it. Next finger is, do you know this one? Hmm. There's a very special thing about this finger when it comes to love. Well, this is the ring finger. And I believe in Russia it's called bezimyani. It means no name. But the ring finger is called the ring finger because when you get married or get engaged, a ring should be put on your finger. So like usually in American culture, it used to be. I don't know what it is now. I don't know now. Don't look at me. Um, the man would get on his knee and put a ring on the girl's ring finger and he would say, will you marry me? And she will say, hell no, or yes. And then they will get married depending on if she said yes or if she said no, they won't get married, okay? Now let's get to the next finger, the littlest, tiniest finger. This is the pinky finger. Now the pinky finger is the smallest. My pinky is actually broken. But yeah, it's the smallest finger, but it's still cool. Now how do we use this pinky finger? Well, some people use the pinky finger to show that they have class or elegance when they're drinking tea. They drink tea and they put their pinky up to show they have class or elegance. I don't do that crap. But anyway, that's what some people do. Now for the last and in my opinion, the most important finger is the thumb. Now how do we use the thumb? Well, if you have Instagram, Contacte, YouTube, whatever, it means you like things. You can show your thumb, it means I like it in this form. But if you don't like it, you show like this. It means thumbs down. It means it's not interesting. Not cool. She's not beautiful. He's not sexy. We're not happy. Thumbs down. So if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you don't like this video, you can just give it a thumbs down and I will completely understand. I will not be angry with you. And so that's basically it, guys. Let me know what you think. Thanks for watching and we are out of here. Goodbye, people.